This is the restart we've been waiting for. Let's see the differential in speed as they get things underway between the two cars right at the front. Celio Avestias in the Mini. Not surprising, he gets the pedal down first, makes Whoa. a little break. Big and in jump. the background, unfortunately, a number of cars coming together on the restart. There are at least three cars involved in that. There are going to be more. Oh dear, oh dear. Red flag, race stop, because others unsighted accelerating into the corner, come across a block circuit. There are more for this. Huge contact there as the Lotus piles in to the back of the Yaris of Lejun Bin. So we've got one upside down. The race has been stopped, understandably. And all of that, I'm afraid, was round about the fifth, sixth, seventh area. Look, there's enormous damage done to Kevin Lamb's car, to the Mini of 96, Chen Kin Sang, and this is what well, it already started by this stage as uh, more piled in. This is Se the collection, isn't it? Yeah. the inevitable collection. But that was a massive hit. It was. I'm afraid your number 72 Peugeot is involved. Right, that's where it went wrong. So it was Chen Kin Sang who was too fast into the corner. Others followed his pace and got it wrong. And now, of course, the next wave has just got nowhere to go. And that was a massive hit for 32 of uh, Lin Lee up from the back of the grid and she really caught for the biggest hit of all and then there jacking number two Yaris into the air Lei Jun Bin's car being given a mighty whack the Lotus has buried itself underneath so um, oh dear more drama elsewhere around the lap oh dear oh dear and Rui Valance's car is one of them and Celio Diash's car is that it is the it leader's is. car so what has happened coming through Reservoir three minis have got themselves together one of which was the leader so Lohman. there is absolute mayhem. Lowman Fire's car as well, the yep. number seven car. It's, um, yes, it's not been a good restart, has it? So here is, all right, Celio yeah. Diaz loses it. Yep. Cool tyres. The Fiesta gets the lead, does it? So the Mini bounces across the road. Which way does the Fiesta go? Just jinx around. Lowman Fire's got nowhere to go. And Rui Vallant has his own incident in avoidance. Crikey. So look, there's Chin Kin Sang, he gets it wrong. Kevin Lam hits the barrier. Then the Peugeot piles in of Lam Hong Fai. Others are just fortunate enough to find a gap left or right. But then from the back of the grid, Lin Lee gives Kevin Lam's car a mighty whack. The Yaris goes in. Now, the, wait, the red flags are out. And here's the Lotus that has nowhere to go except underneath the Yaris. Jacks the car into the air. Some drivers, of course, were accelerating. Others were responding to the red flags as they saw them. But in a way, it was potluck. You just got a gap or you didn't. But some big, big hits. Look, the Yaris goes in. Actually, number two there, not that damaged. Wait for it. Bang! That is a huge hit. And the number of impacts that Kevin Lamb's Chevrolet had is quite severe. But there is the leader throwing away what was the advantage. And wait for the red flags to come out. Look, he's halfway through the incident. There are the reds. We're not done yet because bang, in goes number seven mini of Loman Fai and Rui Vallant having his own drama.